having had a long history with drug and alcohol abuse, I, um, I ended up in the Lycoming County prison system in November of 2015. Um, and after being accepted onto the Lycoming County Treatment Court program, uh, I needed a home plan. So in April of 2016, um, I started residing here. January 31st of 2017, I regained full legal and physical custody of my daughter, thanks to Liberty House. I can remember getting your application and thinking, oh Lord, I'm a little nervous about this one. <laughs> You're always a little hesitant in the beginning. And I move her in and she was so determined. She was ready to work a program. She was ready to change her life. It got to the point where it was like, you know, I was crying wolf. And, you know, it got to the point where no one believed me. So I was kind of guarded when I came in and expecting no one to believe me that I really wanted to change my life around. I actually knew Julie from when she was in her addiction. Um, so I've seen her come full circle from the addiction to where she is right now, as successful as she is. I knew that she had my back, and like she said, if I put in 110%, she was going to give that back to me. And I never had anyone do that for me before, at least recently. Homelessness is, 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 is crazy here in Lycoming County. Um, I have applications that come through the door every day. It, it's just, it's a really, it's a struggle in Lycoming County and I don't think that too many people are very aware of how big of an issue it is. I've seen several women um, that I was here with um, succeed in uh, getting jobs, finding their own place to live, um, because they have the opportunity to be here for up to two years. And it's a stable place. Um, it's a safe place. We really wouldn't honestly be able to, to run as smoothly as we do without Lycoming like, United Way funding. Um, I always tell my clients that we rely on all of our funding to keep our programs going. You know, we do use the HUD funding, um, and HUD funding then is matched by the Lycoming County United Way funding to help keep our programs intact.